Alright, what's up YouTube? Welcome back to another video. I have not posted in a long time, but I do have some news here. I'm making a Jake Paul diss track. It should be coming out fairly soon. But besides that point, I'm here with Alex. He's uh, videotaping right now. And we're waiting for Dicks to open, and it opens in 12 minutes. So we're kind of just standing out here. And... Uh, yeah, because we need to get some fishing stuff, because we think we're going to be doing a catch and cook. But we're also going to be trying to catch some big bass, toads, um, something donkeys, I don't even know. But, um, anyways, today should be a good day, and, uh, yeah, let's get into it. Oh, bad. They won't open, and there's like two minutes, or a minute, until the store opens, and they're all just sitting there, like, it doesn't take... We've been here for 30 minutes. It doesn't take 30 minutes to turn the lights on and let the customers in. Like, just open a bit early. Like, in this window, there's a lady just standing there, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, look, they're all just standing there. They're all just standing there. But, you know, oh well, because. Anyway, so, we just wait and hope till this uh, opens up. They finally opened the store about two minutes later from that last clip. But, uh, yeah, we're heading to the fishing section now. Yeah. And, um, yeah, hopefully we can find the stuff we're looking for. Today should be a good day. All right, guys, I don't know why this is so expensive, but I'm going to get some of these right here. And I think I'm going to get a bobber. I, I probably need two bobbers, so I'll get, like, two of these or something. I'll get, I'll get two. I'll get a green one and an orange one. Yeah, I want to see if I want any other baits while I'm here. Alright guys, so I ended up getting these, these uh, package of 10 hooks and then these bobbers. I really hate these bobbers, I only like getting like the long kind of bobbers, but those were like $5 each, so I got these for like $129. So yeah, and we're going to go head over to Pit Trip right now, and um, go get some live bait, and uh, we should be all set. Guys, we got we got the first fish here, second cast with the uh, worm and stuff. So yeah. All right, we already got one sunfish on the string, but we've bought in like ten total so far. But there's so much uh, fish biting out here, like it, like every two casts or even every cast. Like watch this. Right? Yeah, Dude, that's going on the string. Yeah, that is. Look at that. I told you to keep biting. <laughs> Sweet. Bring this guy up. Let's bring it up. All right. So we caught seven sunfish. Not total, but and not eating total. size one. And we, seven keepers. And lucky I have this, and he had a random bag in his backpack. <laughs> Anyways, uh, we put him in here because we don't feel like biking, but where are we going to go stop and eat on the way back? Zolis. I could use like one of them pick two five dollar meal things. See we got the fish in here. We got seven of them. And we're going to cut them up. And I'm sorry that we didn't get very much clips uh, catching them. But we got a total of like 35 to 40 fish the whole time. And uh, we're going to go and play them up. This board right here. So uh... Yeah. Alright guys, we got all seven fish out here and um, we're going to try to fill this up. Before, if you don't want this um, 
graphic content, then skip ahead. Find that backbone right in there. Let's get right through here. show you the recipe on how to make this. Filet? You got a filet, right? These are really little filets, but this is only like half of it. Less than half of it. Well, all the half is right in there. And so what you want to do is you want to dip it in this egg stuff right here. Both sides. Like that. I'm going to set this here. You want to get salt and pepper. Right, and then you're going to want to get this some um, flour and you don't want your sister to get in the way. So, what you're gonna do, is you get some of this flour in here. Anyone who finds my keys, Not very much, and we're videotaping. Oh. And, um, you wanna put some flour in there. Oh, they're Flour. You can always shake that extra flour off. Like that. More flour means more crispy. Exactly. And you wanna soak that right in there with flour. You're gonna wanna spread that around in there. That around, Sp spread it all around and stuff. That super good. You're gonna shake it off, turn it upside down, shake it off, turn it upside down. You know, and I just remembered that we forgot to heat the pan. Um, yeah, so that once you got all of them turned over, you do it again. Yes. Pound down the flour. Pound down some flour, yes. Today, we are mad because we didn't catch any slange donkeys. I know. And then you gotta, gotta, gotta swing around. And then, my personal favorite part is that you wanna get the breadcrumbs on. Possibly. We went out and bought some of these panko breadcrumbs. Favorite thing, it's what makes the thing crispy and not taste just like this. You went ahead and open these up. Look at this. Those are, that's a beautiful right there. Oh, yeah. Alright, so then you're going to want to get a new spoon. I don't know why I'm saying this, but you're going to get some of this breadcrumbs. And then you're just going to want to throw it, as I like to say. Just got to throw it on there. Never have too many breadcrumbs. Nope. Just gonna toss them on there. And then you'll flip them over and do the exact same thing. Then we're gonna go ahead and toss it on the pan. Best part is you never use that spray butter, that cheap stuff. You never wanna use it. You wanna use real butter when you're cooking this. How come look at this? You just get like, you whip up some right there. Make it come off your fork. And then you just gotta let that sit and melt all around the thing. You'll get like two chunks of this butter. And then the best taste ever, I swear. It's so good. I mean, the butter's unhealthy, but fish is one of the most healthiest foods out there. And um, it's going to taste super good after biting 30 miles. So, yeah. There we go. Let's keep it here because you're going to want to add more later. And then let's go ahead and toss some of these fillets on the uh, pan. I'm just going to make sure this is still spread around a little more even. Alright. We got all the recipes and stuff done. So we're going to want to grab some and just toss it right on there. And guys, keep in mind, these aren't um, our biggest fillets. Our biggest fillets are 
in that container there, ready to go in the fridge because we can't eat seven sunfish straight in a row because that's too much. So yeah, we'll get uh check back in when they're a little bit more um cooked.